Three, two, one, ignition and liftoff. The science of spinal decompression actually began with observations made in space. It was discovered that during weightlessness, the pressure on astronaut spinal columns was reduced and disk space was increased. In some cases, astronauts experienced five to seven centimeters of growth during space flight. And now, through the DRX-9000, Axiom Worldwide duplicates elements of this phenomenon here on Earth. During each painless 30-minute treatment, pressure between discs is reduced, drawing water, oxygen, and nutrients to the damaged area. This acts to naturally rehydrate and gradually rebuild the injured disc. As the pressure on the disc decreases, pressure on the spinal nerves is relieved. Bulging disc material retracts and damaged structures of the spine are healed and rehabilitated. And joining me now is one of the leading neurosurgeons in the country, Dr. Robert Hudgens out of Presbyterian Hospital in Dallas. Dr. Hudgens, thanks so much for joining us. You have two of these DRX machines in your office. Let's talk about the science of spinal decompression and exactly how it works. Well, with spinal decompression, what we're decompressing is the disc between the vertebra. I brought this little model to show that the spine is made up of vertebra that are stacked upon each other, and between each vertebra is a cartilage pad called the disc. And that disc has a soft center that's sort of 80% water. It's a gel, and that absorbs the force and allows the spine to move in all directions. The outside of the disc is a tough capsule that holds all that together. Well, with time or with stresses, that capsule will stretch and that disc will lose some of its fluid content. And as it bulges out, that puts a stress on the surface of the disc where the nerves are, and that gives back pain. If the bulge or protrusion gets out there far enough, it'll hit one of these nerves that comes off the spine. At each level, there's a big nerve that comes off called the spinal nerve, and it goes right over the back edge of the disc. These nerves come out and join together and form the sciatic nerve that runs down the leg. So when we want to get rid of back pain, we want to put a pull on the spine to pull these vertebrae apart to reduce the pressure within the disc. That's the decompression. That allows the disc to settle back into place. It lowers that pressure so that fluid flows back into the disc and restores the height of the disc. Nutrients go into the disc, and it's a way of repairing it without any type of invasive surgery. Is it a short-term fix or is it a longer-term fix? No, in my experience, this has been holding up long term quite well. And avoiding surgery for a lot of patients. Yes, a lot of patients that I see are actually sent for surgery and I've given them this alternative and in the great majority of cases, it's uh, let them get rid of their pain without having to have surgery.